Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the featherweight bout between Bill Algio versus Kyle Nelson. And how do I feel about this one right here is I'm going average confidence um Bill Algio to beat Kyle Nelson. Um yeah, Kyle Nelson is a solid fighter. I feel like his best weight class is 55 to be honest. Not that it really is the same to be honest, to be honest, to be honest. He ain't going too far at 55, he ain't going too far at 45. Wouldn't be fight for him, to be honest, here for Kyle Nelson, but I think Bill Algeo is a talent, more talented fighter. I think he's a more quick fighter. I think he's a more technical fighter. I think Bill Algeo's issue has never really been power. I think, I think that's really the main advantage Kyle Nelson will have, maybe strength and power. And I don't feel like his offensive wrestling, I know it's underrated, but I don't think it's to the degree that's going to cause Bill Algeo so much issue. I feel like Bill, he might have some limited success with it. If anything, that's going to just take away his success on the feet and his punch or chance. He's probably going to wear his own arms down trying to take him down and grab him, trying to hold him down. And Bill Algeo is easy to take down, but he's not typically the easiest guy to hold down. So you can get takedowns in a close fight and likely look to edge it with those takedowns. But yeah, that's probably going to wear your arms down, take the pop of your punches. Then Bill Algeo is going to be flowing and just throwing more value and cleaner combinations and just take advantage of a guy that's not following the greatest game plan. I don't really have this necessary style to follow game plan. So I feel like it's, he don't have the technique. I feel like Aldo has a technique, technical advantage. Then in the speed advantage, then I feel like in the grappling, Kyle Nelson could have a semblance of an advantage as far as like the, who can get the takedowns and win that battle of like, you know, who can score the takedowns, he can win that battle potentially, but at what cost? And I think the cost is not really worth the lack of a reward. So yeah, I feel like Bill Algeo should be at a, Address the grappling, be the cleaner, more technical fighter. I don't think he stops Kyle Nelson, but I do think he outstrikes him. I do think he beats the decision. Just being a sharper, quicker, more technical fighter and being able to address the grappling of Nelson. And I think the power is going to be too big an issue, especially as the fight goes on. It's just going to, that power is going to dwindle and it's going to become predictable. And the more quicker technical fighter is going to be able to read that predictability and capitalize on landing shots, get out and hit and don't be hit. That's the nature of the game. And beat him by decision. So. In this one, I got Bill Algio via decision. 